U.S. Census Bureau shows Arizonans spend the second highest at restaurants because of inflation. That's according to USA Today. KGO 9's Andrew Christensen spoke with a local restaurant in the foothills about how prices have impacted them and their customers over the past few years. In the past two years, the owner of Vivace restaurant tells me that prices have gone up for a lot of items, especially for fillets, veal, and fish. He says those fillets have gone up from about $18 to about $24 per pound. And even though things are stabilizing, he tells me that some prices are still going up. At Vivace restaurant, good to see you. Owner Daniel Scordato takes pride in the quality of his food. I use very, very high quality ingredients compared to um, my prices. But those prices for ingredients going up in the past few years. 2021 was, wasn't bad, but 22 was really tough for us. Profits in 22 were the lowest they ever were that, since I've been going for 30 years. Scordato says he had to make a tough decision, raising some prices about 6%. I was afraid to raise prices. You know, there's, there's, uh, I, I, I don't want to scare people away. In Arizona, a USA Today analysis of a U.S. Census Bureau study says in November, people spent about $97 in a two-week period at restaurants, in June going up to about $119. For some people in the foothills, rising restaurant prices aren't really a problem. I still want to go out. You get a little stir crazy when I get out of the house. I went out last year and I'm going out this year and enjoy going out to eat. Even though Scordato is hoping he doesn't have to raise his prices on customers again, he's celebrating the ones that keep coming back. As long as I'm doing the volume, I want to do volume and, and that's what keeps us uh, in business. Reporting on Skyline and Campbell in Tucson, Andrew Christensen, KGUN 9.